I was walking downtown with rainwater in my socks when I saw this young brother get hemmed up by the cops. This skinhead pig looking as racist as he could grabbed this kid by the neck and smashed his face against the hood. And though I was clearly a witness to this excessive force, he looked a tad stunned when I took down his badge number. He said, you damn youngsters, black or white, you're all alike. I said, my name is Ezra, what's yours? My name is Mike. Well, Mike, I'm just trying to defend this guy's rights, you know, the ones you're supposed to protect with your life? He said, oh yeah, that's right, thanks for showing me my mistake. I guess it's time I take my fist about this kid face and shake his hand. Treat him like a man. Ask him what the problem is. The adrenaline hit and I reacted with dominance. So he apologized. The kid said, it's cool. And right about that time is when I noticed pigs flew. In reality, I just stood there and watched it go down. I should have rocked the boat, but I just stood my own ground. See, it was a test and I failed it, knowing that I was failing because I was afraid to risk finding myself in jail. And that's how they keep us down. So open up and listen, I'm just hoping something 